my first grilled cheese. Okay, so I had my first grilled cheese today, and I have to say it was a failure. So as you might be realizing by now, if you've been watching my videos since day one, you might be noticing that I can't cook or I haven't been cooking that much so I don't really know how to do things and I'm a bit too lazy to actually look up how to do things. You would be correct. So, I decided that to make my grilled cheese, I should ask one of my friends. So I did. I was on the phone and they were giving me step by step some instructions. I wasn't a very good listener. <laughs> Um, so the first instruction they told me to do was put butter in the pan. Now, keep in mind, I live in the South. We put butter in everything. So I took some of our earth-balanced soy-free butter, and I put some in a pan. And then I toasted up the first slice, both sides, and I did the other one and added more butter. And then I put two slices of a cheese on one side of the bread and put that as the bottom in the pan. So it was bread, cheese, bread. And then the bread started smoking, so I decided that I should probably flip it over. And as I did, I realized that one, the cheese had already melted. I just couldn't tell because I've never made grilled cheese. I've no idea what it looks like. And it ended up looking burnt. Like... This was the picture that I made to put on my blog, and if my blog ever comes back up, I will, if I remember. But this is what it looked like. So, obviously it wasn't very tasty. For one, I, maybe if you make it the right way or something, maybe it was the way that I was told to make it. But the bread was greasy and just, ugh. And on top of that, it was burned. And then the cheese inside did not go with the bread. And maybe I'll try it again with something else, with like a different something. Or maybe just have somebody make me some so that I'm not eating my catastrophe all the time. But, um... After that, I decided to make a smoothie, which was a great success. I can blend things. So we have a mixed bag of Publix frozen fruit. It has raspberries, blackberries, blueberries, and strawberries in it. And I took a almond yogurt plain, and I dumped that in the blender along with some of the mix. And that turned out great. It was very tasty and very energizing. So all in all, it ended well for lunch. Alright, remember to like, share, and subscribe. Bye loves!